Ahoy oh, there, Legion! Got another Warframe Test Rank Challenge Chamber War Room Bonanza for you all today. Luckily it's not too bad, but all in all, I like it because it mixes up pretty much all the good stuff you normally do together without focusing on one thing too much. You got the running, the shooting, all that good stuff. No melee, but uh, as that wasn't really reworked until recently, it doesn't really, you know, it's fine, it's all good, it's all good. I don't want to spoil anything, but let's just say if you ever wondered if the phrase practice makes perfect meant anything, it most certainly does. Get ready for the turnaround of the century, Legion. As Lotus suggests, these platforms fall after a few seconds, so you have a hidden enrage timer going on in the background. What past me lacked in experience, he most certainly made up for with gusto. Look at him go. Just seconds into the match and already steamrolling the platforms like the last Twinkie on the shelf during a zombie apocalypse. Now, you might note a chime going off. That's to let you know exactly when the platforms disappear. All out of room, Rhino decides to make a leap of faith. Only he forgets to think of happy thoughts, so we gotta do this all over again. Okay, we know the ground rules. Let's do this. As the enemies all seem to be level 1, you can bring whatever weapon you'd like and should be able to complete it a lot faster than me as I decided to stick with my rocket launcher. I love me some ogres. Now this is actually a very bad choice and a huge handicap as I'm only hitting one target at a time, the AoE is completely underutilized and I have to line up the missile perfectly or I'll miss entirely and have to fire again. Then add in the reload time and ugh, bad stuff. Plus if I roll on the landing I have to recharge the shot or reload again and it wipes the progress on doing so. Not cool. In the end, I'd suggest going the same route I did here, jump diagonally to a corner and hop from outer platform to outer platform, picking off whatever enemies that wander in front of your scope. This will avoid you having to make a long jump like I did on the first run, as even with the speed bonus, my slow chassis could not make the gap. I keep flashing back to my vain attempts to ford the river in the past. So many oxen. Lost forever. Meager rations and dysentery and got nothing on rivers, I'll tell you what. Sure, those 10,000 pounds of pure lead ammunition might have weighed down the carriage slightly, but, uh... How else are we going to collect 50 pounds of meat and leave the other 400 to rot in the sun? It's not about the rations. It's about sending a message. Thank you for watching, Legion. If this video helped you out in any way or gave you a bit of a chuckle, we'd be honored if you liked and shared this video with your fellow Tenno. We always appreciate it when you do. If you liked what you saw and you want to come back again, stay up to date on what we does. Button on the right will help you out there. Just click that subscribe button. And it'll set you on your way to greatness and awesomeness in the future. As always, if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave a comment below. Catch you next time, Legion. Take care.